Um, yeah, you know, um, at the start of the year I wouldn't have imagined it. Um, coming into this week I can, you know, been playing really well all year and um, got a lot of confidence behind me. So for me, coming into this week I felt like I could really get up there and contend. Um, so I'm not, I'm not surprised that I'm leading after three rounds, but um, you know, take it in its stride and see what happens tomorrow. And what do you put this year down to? Just a lot of hard work, you know, I think it's just been the coming of, you know, changing coach, golf coach uh, a couple of years ago and I've just really become, sort of the last year, just really become comfortable in, in my golf swing and just hitting the shots that I know I can, you know, where uh, before I felt like I was very one dimensional, hit a big draw all the time, where now I feel like I can go out there and get it left flags, get it right flags, and I think that's just helped me avoid uh, shooting those scores. Everybody talks about your attitude and how, how well you say things like, well, if I wasn't here, you know, I would be far less pleasant life. How important will it be is the fact that you do have such a good attitude? I mean, do, you, do you have to try and make sure that you maintain this attitude? Or is of course it, I do, yeah. Are you yeah. Cheerily, na of course, naturally yeah. cheery? No, I'm, I'm pretty happy go lucky at times, but golf's a frustrating game, you know, it frustrates hell out of most of us, but, you know, sometimes you just have to tell yourself and put things into perspective and then you just look at it like that, and I think, you know, where I've come from and having a family now, I think that's just put things in a massive perspective for me and, um, you know, like I say, we got home to Ruby and she don't know if Daddy's played good or bad as long as she smiles and it's all good for me, you know. And if you had to say there was one aspect of your game that would be really terrific this year, what would it be? Uh, putting, I've hundred percent. I mean, I think I'm, in putts again, I'm, I'm pretty much gaining like plus four putts a week now on the field, so, which is massive. Um, just yeah, we, no, no, no. We had a we had a lighter putter in the bag at the start of the year. And we changed to a heavier one, and it's just it's just how we get in the bunnies because we've got quite a short putter. It's 30 inches, so we had to replace the weight somehow and put it in a mid-size head. And it's just been been a massive difference for us. You mentioned Andy, the three wins you've had have come in three different ways. How good would it be to be to win it going head to head with Rory McIlroy in the final round in the last? Yeah. Game? It'd be, you know, it'd be an absolute dream come true, you know, um, obviously to play, play against Rory as good as he is, you know, so um, try not to think about it too much if I'm honest, but, um, you know, I'm, like I say, I'm just going to go out there and enjoy the day. Last time I played Rory in Dubai, I um, had an absolute ball out there, so hopefully um, go out there and do the same thing. Right. Thanks very much. Cheers, well, guys. Well, Thanks. Thanks. What did you put away?